friends, welcome back. They are young, they are beautiful, they are smart, and they are so tough. Get ready to meet right here a couple of young boxing champions. Nadia, you're 12. Nayeli, you are 10. Thank you for being here. How are you guys feeling? Good. Good. Okay, so listen to this. This just in from Coach Jay Garcia right there, Saginaw Boxing Club. Nadia, you are ranked the number one fighter in the Bantam division for 119 pounds. Wow. And Nayeli, you're tied for number two in America. You guys, how does that make you feel? You're top notch. Um, it makes me feel good. Like yeah. I'm proud of myself because this, this is what I've been working for. Yeah, you're right at the top of all the fighters. I mean, you put in a lot of hard work. Talk yeah. to me about that. It, yeah, it makes me feel proud too, and like happy and doing yeah. the hard work. Yeah. You know, you guys, recently they both won gold medals in the USA Boxing Championships. So what was that like when they announced the winner is? <laughs> um, when they had picked my hand up yeah. when they announced it. Oh, so they did the whole, yeah. like, yeah. And okay. then I had jumped up and I was screaming. I was excited because, <laughs> like, I just won national champions, like. It's a good feeling. Now who's that? <laughs> there, yeah. Oh my gosh. There's you. Oh my gosh, Nadia. I can imagine the feeling that was going through all your hard work right there, and you just made your <laughs> dream come true. Mm -hmm. Nayali, what was that like for you? And they said, "Oh my God, the winner." Um, I was just happy. I didn't care what nobody thinks. I know. I, I know what they thought. So did the, the, they did this for you too, Nayali? Yeah, mm -hmm. the winner is. That must be. It's so exciting when you, when you see that, you mm -hmm. know, in there. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Coach Jay. He is from the uh, Saginaw Boxing Club, so you must be so proud I am, of your boxers. I am. When they yeah. won, I was crying. <laughs> they put a lot of hard work into it, yeah. and just to see, you know, their hard work pay off, how much they ran, how much they sacrificed. Talk to me about like, that just, sacrifice and that training. What do, what do they go through when they're training? Uh, they did a lot of running. We run um, 10 miles a week, so two wow. miles a day at minimum oh my gosh. for five days a week. And we time them. I run with them. And we just try to push them uh, yeah. as much as we can push them. Um, they're eating, they're dieting, they're mm. texting me, Coach, can I eat this? Coach, right, can I right. eat this? And yes, no, yes, right, no. Right. So just a lot of sacrifices they made, missing birthday parties mm -hmm. or missing other things and come to the gym, come to the gym early, sometimes stay a little late. Yeah. But it's just a lot of sacrifices. So they, what's that like, young girls? Because you both, Nadia and Nayeli, you're young and you want to go out and have mm -hmm. fun, but you're also committed and you're passionate to box, right? So what's it like to sacrifice? I mean, I mean, sometimes like there be days where like I want to go to my friend's house yeah. and I want to go hang out, but then it's just like I'll be thinking like your your opponents in the gym. <laughs> That's right. And so like you might as well go to the gym. You better get in there and, and it's worth it. Though. Work it out. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it must be the competitiveness must run in the family. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of G. Okay. <laughs> like, yeah. Everyone's competitive and and all that. What advice do you have to other kids out there? who may have a dream to do something and they're like, what do I do? Um, honestly, just don't like, just keep going at it. Like there's, there's gonna be hard days. Mm -hmm. There's gonna be really bad days. We're gonna wanna give up, but just keep going. Then you'll get to the top and you'll be proud and you won't regret it. You guys are mm -hmm. top boxers. Congratulations. I, you know I am so happy. I love you guys. You guys are so amazing. You keep doing what you're doing and thank you for being such a highlight and inspiration to all the young kids out there. We appreciate you. Keep me updated on your progress, okay, guys? Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Oh, these are awesome. Thank you, Coach. <laughs> Appreciate you. You're so welcome. If you have any ideas of what you would like to see on our show, you can send them to us at WNEM-4PMNews at WNEM.com. Just use the subject 4PM News Spotlight.